we're back out now working with the BMW to try to figure out uh, a temporary agreement that can be, or a tentative agreement that can be taken back out for ratification. Um, I anticipate we're going to be able to do that. Maintenance away employees could drag over into next year. I don't anticipate that. Uh, I think there's a there's a path forward for us to get another tentative agreement, get it back out for vote. And that was Union Pacific CEO Lance Fritz on our air exactly one week ago suggesting that ongoing railroad union votes need to get done this year. But more than 60 percent of the Brotherhood of Railroad Signalmen failed to ratify. And if the railroads fail to reach a deal, we could see a strike as soon as November 19th. Yahoo Finance's Rick Newman has the latest. Rick, so we seem to have seen a scenario like this before. Uh, is there a possible strike on the table? Yes, but importantly, uh, it is not going to happen if it does happen until after the midterm elections on November 8th. So, uh, you know, when this first came up, uh, the President Biden directed the uh, Labor Secretary, Marty Walsh, he basically said, get this resolved. And it looked like it was resolved in October, but then we had one union that said, no, we're not ratifying this. And now we have a second one. So my best guess is uh, they will they will get this resolved without a strike. But if they don't, it's a big deal because of all the goods that travel uh, by rail. And we've already got problems with supply chains that are uh, one of the factors pushing prices up with to 8.2 uh, percent inflation and higher for some things like food. So uh, the government needs to get involved uh, to get this resolved, which I think it probably will. But it may go down to the wire close to uh, November 19th.